Hey friends, Miranda here, back with another grocery haul. This one is a pretty big one because it is that time to pretty much stock up on everything. And plus, the kiddos are going back to school next week, so I had to get a few extra goodies, things for like their lunches and stuff like that. You know how it goes. Um, so today I spent $314, you guys. Um, I went to grocery outlet you guys know that's my all-time favorite store to go to they have the best deals and you definitely get more for your dollar so uh yeah <laughs> without further ado let's just go ahead and get right into this haul you guys because there's quite a bit to get through got all the stuff on the table or some stuff on the chair and then I do have some stuff on the counter in the kitchen so uh, I did go ahead and pick up a couple things of black beans just because I wanted to make chili here one of these days real soon and I was out of black beans so I went ahead and got a couple cans got a couple cans of pineapple uh, my two oldest kiddos they love pineapple so I got this mostly like for their lunches and stuff um, I got a thing of cauliflower some cabbage uh, some cantaloupes they were two for five um, I got this big thing of green grapes couple things of the Hunt's traditional pasta sauce, couple things of cream of chicken because I was running low. I was completely out of my chicken bouillon stuff. This is like the, well actually this is the Masola brand, it's not the North Suiza, but um, you know, I go through this stuff a lot, you guys, pretty much it goes into everything. Um, I did go ahead and pick up a small thing of peanut butter. I'm definitely going to have to probably get like a bigger one because I'm Obviously going to be going through a lot of that <laughs> with the kiddos. Um, I did go ahead and get some syrup. A few cans of these SpaghettiO meatballs. Kiddos love this stuff. Um, and then this, you guys. <gasps> this is kind of more for me. But the kiddos, I mean, I can put some of these in their lunch and stuff. But this is the Sugar River Original Beef Stick Ends and Pieces. This stuff is so good. I got this. I don't know if it was the same brand, but I got something similar. It was like the ends a while back. Um, and so, yeah, these are just so good, you guys. Great little kind of thing to snack on there. I did go ahead and get some bananas, some baby carrots, obviously for lunches and uh, for meals and stuff like that. I did go ahead and get two things of celery. Um, so I told my kiddos that I would put them like, you know, celery and like peanut butter or celery and ranch um, in their lunch. And I'm trying to get my youngest to eat more veggies, but uh, she ain't having it. So, um, but she said she's going to try some celery. So we'll see if that's true. Then a staple, as always, I got this bag of tilapia fillets. It is three pounds. The last bag I got, I believe it had like 25 in it. Yes, they are a bit more on the smaller side, but you know, it's kind of more for like portion control and stuff. Um, but this easily I can get you know, anywhere from like two to three meals for my family of five, um, just depending on what I am making. Um, but I always, always get this. Then I did go ahead and pick up two of these four pound bags of the boneless, skinless chicken breast by Sunland. And you can see you get quite a bit in there, you guys. Um, this is another staple when they have it. Um, but if they don't have it, then they usually always have like the Tyson brand or some other brand. Um, but I did get two of those. I got two loaves of white bread and then, sorry, my cats are going crazy over here. Um, anywho, I did go ahead and pick up a big bag of the uh, chile arbol. They did not have the guajillo, which I really needed, but it is what it is. I have to go find it somewhere else. Um, then I did go ahead and get some butter because I was out. Uh, I did also pick up a thing of this budding premium deli smoked turkey breast. Um, it's a one pound, so you get like two packages in there. So just for like some sandwiches. Um, sometimes I like for the kiddos for lunch, I'll like uh, just kind of like roll these up and you know give them like some crackers and sort of like a lunchable kind of thing, you know, which is also where that pepperoni comes in for kind of homemade lunchables. Got some mayo here, and then some of the little bites, the party cake ones. Kiddos love these. Then they had these back again, which is awesome. Um, so we have the Unicorn Magic Cupcake. So this is pudding, but it's like purple and blue in color. And then, oh my goodness, I kind of wish I would have gotten more because I like these, and my two oldest kids like these. These are the banana flavored pudding. Actually, they, they uh, added like little pictures and stuff to it now, if you can see there. So 
that's kind of cute. But yeah, those are fun and they are pretty yummy. I think, oh yeah, it is, I guess like a cupcake flavor now that I think about it. So pretty good. I got a couple bags of hearts of romaine. My son was with me and he's like, mom, I'll eat salad, but just no veggies in it. So he doesn't like the garden blend. So I went ahead and got the hearts of romaine, which me too, I kind of personally prefer. Um, but uh, got that. And then I also picked up a pack, a 20 count of the Guerrero flour tortillas. Went ahead and picked up a couple more bags of the frozen corn. It's just, you guys, canned corn has gotten so much more expensive. Like, I just cannot pay no freaking, like, 80 cents to, like, a dollar, dollar something for a can of corn. I mean, even, like, Walmart, their, their corn isn't 50 cents anymore. Um, so I'm kind of just resulting to getting the... Uh, frozen corn here because it's I mean 99 cents and you get more in it so you know it is what it is um, I got three things of this uh, grass-fed ground beef uh, then I also went ahead and picked up this thing of already cooked shrimp um, you get 61 to 70 counts so it's roughly a pound of shrimp here um, some turkey bacon. I've kind of been obsessed with this lately. Um, so got that. And then I got this big old thing of uh, pork chops over here. Got this. I believe it's a five pound bag of gala apples. Got some potatoes here. Some russet potatoes. Oatmeal cream pies. Two gallons of 1% milk. Salts because it's completely out. Then I got two packages of the Guerrero tortillas. Normally I get calidad, but if they don't have the calidad available, uh, which they didn't today, I always get the Guerrero. Got a package of corn dogs here, some uh, Linden Farms tater tots. Um, now the pizza rolls. My youngest, she is pizza is like her favorite food, and she absolutely loves the Totino's pizza rolls but they only had the cheese flavor and she didn't like it and me either like i like the pepperoni pizza rolls but i don't like the cheese ones um and so i didn't want to get her the cheese ones and so they only had this brand the michelinas um i've never had these she's never had them so hopefully they compare and uh, she'll like them um because they were way cheaper this was like five bucks and you get 90 in here which you guys know normally the 90 count of like the totinos goes for like 10 bucks um so gonna go ahead and give those a try then got this huge bag of these dino buddies chicken nuggets these are actually our favorite um and now that we actually have an air fryer um you know we can totally do uh chicken nuggets in there and stuff but it's four and a half pounds it was a little on the pricey side but then again for the amount that's actually in here it's kind of a good deal so it was like 12 bucks you guys but I, previously we've gotten like the boxes that are like kind of on the smaller side and those go for like six bucks and it's not even like a, probably like a quarter of what's in this bag. So um, I think it's a pretty good deal. Then they had these uh, Light and Fit by Dannon. Little four count of this strawberry yogurt. These were only 77 cents. Um, then I got this bag of Takis Waves. My two oldest, they love Takis, so I thought I would go ahead and get those for them to try out. Got a couple things of the uh, Southern Recipe Grand's Southern Home Style Biscuits. These were only 99 cents. Good deal there. Um, I did get two uh, packs of the chicken drumsticks here. You can see um, some burritos and then this you guys oh my goodness I was so happy to see this so we have the Hillshire Farms little Smokies you guys these are only 250 a piece and so I got three of them because normally the little packages it's about like half of this go for a, anywhere from like three to five dollars for the little pack um, with the way prices are looking right now and a pack like this usually goes for probably like I want to say like seven bucks or so is what I've seen like at Winco um, So I got three Three packs of the little smokies there um, I have been craving little smokies in the crock pot with some of my uh, little like sauce that I make it Has like barbecue and some other things and so I wanted to do those for a while now 
Um, we finished up our little hash browns when my mom and sister were over. And so we just needed some more to have on the hand. Got a couple things of hot dogs here. And then this too, I was happy to see. I love these V8 splash juices. So, so good. This is a pineapple coconut. These are only two bucks a piece, you guys. They do sell like individual size bottles at Dollar Tree, but I don't always come across them. And you know, for the size, you know, if you were to just buy them individually, you're, it's probably about like maybe four or five of those. Um, in here so I thought for two bucks it's a pretty good deal so I went ahead and got two of those so coming over here to the counter I got a thing of Colby Jack cheese this is a I believe it's like what is this a two pound bag of cheese then I came across these snack wells or the devil's food cookie cakes these were only 47 cents a box so like two for a buck um went ahead and got those all of the granola bars you guys were 99 cents so we got this uh chewy dips the llama rama they've had this like a uh, several times now and um, so for a dollar to get 14 uh granola bars good deal um they had the nature valley for 99 cents this is the fruit and nut and this one is the sweet and salty um then i was totally down to like my last bag of pasta you guys and uh so i kind of had to stock up here so i got two of the macaroni two of the penne and then two of the shells also got the enchilada sauce and then i saw this and i had to get it you guys i love like guava juice guava water anything like that so i i just i had to get that one um then i also got the quaker chewy uh variety pack you get chocolate chip peanut butter chocolate chip and then the cookies and cream so we're 99 cents so i got two of those then we got the oreo thin bites 12 count i believe this was like two dollars if i'm not mistaken um, then I did go ahead and get these uh, pretzel cinnamon sugar pop tarts and I also got the hot fudge sundae. Um, then I got some Gatorades here. They had these mango ones for 69 cents. Um, these are the 20 flow ounce um, and then the bigger ones were 99 cents. So I got a few of the uh, tropical cooler and a few of the what is this one the cool blue and these are the 32 flow ounce. All right, moving along to everything here on the chair. You guys, giant size. I have never seen a box of cereal this big. It was only $2, so I had to get it. It's the Captain Crunch, but this thing is ginormous. Like, for real, I've never seen a box of cereal this big in my entire life. It is a 28-ounce box. Crazy. Um, then we also got the Family Size French Toast Crunch. Got five dozen eggs, and then I got two of the orange Kool-Aid Jammers. Um, then we got Hot Pockets here. I got the pepperoni pizza ones for my youngest. Those are her favorite. And my oldest likes the ham and cheddar. I'll eat them both. Um, then I thought this was a really good deal. This I thought would be perfect. Even if it's just for snacking or if we're kind of running late in the morning and they just need something to go, um, this could be a breakfast option. But you get 22 packs in here. And you guys, this was only three bucks. Normally, I forget if the individual packs have like four or six in them. Um, but I know they go for about like three bucks a box. So this was a really, really good deal, you guys. But you get the Tiger Paws, you get the Fruit Loops, and you get the Apple Jacks. And last but not least, I got this 20 uh, pack variety of the Treetop Applesauce. You get cinnamon, strawberry, and apple. I thought this was a really good deal, you guys. It was six bucks. Normally, that that's the price that like the 12 pack would go for. Actually, it goes for even more than that, I believe. Um, so for six bucks, 20 pack of the uh, applesauce. Thought that was a pretty good deal, so got that. That is everything for this haul, you guys. So stocked up. I was running out of a lot of things and just getting ready for back to school next week. So that is it for today. Thank you so, so much for watching. Join the family if you have not, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.